What's up, Brad Squad? This is Jonathan Elias out here in the cold streets of New York, and today I'm feeling a little thankful. Can you guys guess why? It's because this is the week of Thanksgiving. Now, Thanksgiving started off as a day to give thanks for the blessings of the harvest of the preceding year. We're gonna go around and we're gonna quiz some people on some Thanksgiving trivia, and we're gonna ask them what they're thankful for. I want you guys to play along and also let me know what you're thankful for. Let's go. <laughs> the first question. Where was the first Thanksgiving dinner in the United States held? Was it A, Concord, New Hampshire, B, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, C, Plymouth, Massachusetts, or D, Dover, Delaware? Uh, B? C? C, you got it! <laughs> it was Plymouth, Massachusetts, you got it! <laughs> Plymouth? You got it, yeah! Look, see? <laughs> I remember from, I guess, Junior high school. There you go. Oh, gosh. I feel like I'm gonna be like made fun of. I'm gonna say Plymouth, Massachusetts. There you go, you got it. It's cool, awesome, great, because I thought of Plymouth Rock. There you go, see? I guess high school and junior high does help for something. Did something, yeah, I guess. did something. All right, what was definitely not on the first Thanksgiving feast table? Was it A, turkey, B, potatoes, C, venison, which is deer meat, or D, seafood? Seafood? That's what I would think, but it was potatoes. Potatoes weren't really big back in oh, the back wow. in the day at that time. That's Isn't true. that? Yeah, I would not think that. See, I would think I, that I they would, would have all the potatoes. I was thinking that or the other choice before this, uh, the, the deer meat. The deer meat. Yeah. Oh yeah, they definitely had deer meat then. I would not think. I'm gonna say turkeys. It was actually potatoes. Really? That's Surprise. interesting. Surprise. Because I knew like it had to be like seafood because you know they came from like they yeah. sailed the freaking oceans. Exactly. I'll say seafood. Seafood is not. I would have thought seafood too, but it's potatoes. actually potatoes. Okay. Yeah, right. they didn't have potatoes back then. Like it wasn't popular back then. On your Thanksgiving table. Has to be collard greens, hey. mac and cheese, yeah. turkey, ham, cranberry sauce, you know. You name it. <laughs> <laughs> now, who is known as the mother of Thanksgiving? Is it A, Sarah Josepha Hale, B, Betsy Ross, C, Martha Stewart, or D, Pocahontas? C. Day. <laughs> it was not Pocahontas. It was A, Sarah Joseph Hill. I'm going to guess Martha Stewart for <laughs> and giggles. And you got it. You got no, no, you got the oh. and giggles. Oh, okay. <laughs> Betsy Ross. I would have thought that too, but it's A, Sarah. Sarah Joseph Hale. She actually was the reason why Thanksgiving became a holiday. So she was basically the one who brought it to Abraham Lincoln to make Thanksgiving a, a holiday. Oh, wow, okay, that's yeah. cool. Yeah, so you learned Good something. Thank God for her. Again. Thank you, Sarah. <laughs> Thanks, Sarah. <laughs> All right, now four. A botched Thanksgiving order led to which invention? A, turkey thermometer. B, turkey burger. C, TV dinners or D, turkey fryer? I would say thermometer. Yeah, that, that makes sense, <laughs> but it was actually a TV dinner. Turkey fryer. Um, D. Turkey fryer. I'm gonna go with the turkey fryer. That sounds about right, but it was actually a TV dinner. Oh, really? Cool. So uh, uh, an employee at CA Swanson and Sons ordered way too many turkeys <laughs> and uh, thought that they would sell out and after Thanksgiving had a bunch so they just cut it up, threw it in uh, oh, aluminum foil so uh, and then made TV dinners. Wow, that's so cool. There you go, now you know. <laughs> yeah. And we like some TV dinners when we in college. True that, <laughs> because it's cheap. <laughs> cheap. Look, easy to make. <laughs> Throw it in the microwave okay. and I'm ready to go. There you go, there you go. All right, two more. Okay. Who was the first president to officially pardon a turkey? Was it Ronald Reagan, Calvin Coolidge, Thomas Jefferson, or George H.W. Bush? So I think every year a president like pardons a turkey, like says, oh, you guys don't oh, kill that oh, turkey. Oh, yes, yes, okay, oh my God. President. Let's just say Thomas Jefferson. Okay, it was George Bush. George Bush, okay. <laughs> Who would have thought? Yeah, not me. <laughs> no, so not okay. many people <laughs> right. either. Uh, Thomas Jefferson, I don't know. A. It is D, George H.W. Oh, Bush. Okay. Yeah. Bush? There you go. <laughs> That's a good <laughs> guess. It's in my mind. I maybe read something about it. But Listen, anyway. I would sit next to you, even if you were guessing. You got a good guess in mind. 
When was the first Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade held here in New York City? Was it A, 1918, B, 1924, C, 1955, or D, 1969? Man, I could swear, like, recently I had remember something, like it was the 75th anniversary or something, mm. or 100. Okay. 50, the 1950... That, that don't sound like 75 years. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go at 1955. Well, let's try another one. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, no wait, that was a stupid <laughs> answer. What's your name? Day. <laughs> Say. Bay. Yes, you got it! <laughs> I don't know, uh, 1918? <laughs> Uh, 24, okay. <laughs> All right. What was the second one? 1924. I think 1924. There you go. See, I knew that you had it in there somewhere. Because it couldn't have been 1918. No, no definitely Because that was, that. no, yeah. okay. <laughs> Last, I want to know, what are you guys thankful for? I'm thankful for my family. Yeah? What are you thankful for, Lala? The same. The same, the family. family. You have an amazing family. What are you thankful for? Oh wow, that's so crazy because I was just like thanking my friends early, like maybe like half an hour ago just for being in my life, but like my friends, my family, all of the support and love that they give me for every choice that I make really. Yeah. And just like my life, I'm really yeah. thankful for my life right now. It's funny that you asked, um, I actually sent a message to all my contacts on my phone like a few days ago because I watched a video of a kid who never saw color in his life and he saw color for the first time in his reaction. Wow. You know, like his reaction just took me and then, yeah, and then I messaged everyone like, be thankful for your fingers, yeah. for the tongue, for the eyes, you know. We take that we for take granted. We take that for granted mm -hmm. and a lot of people don't have those things. So yeah. I'm thankful for like everything, every little, blessing that I've been blessed with. I love that. I absolutely love that. Well, there you have it, Brad Squad. That was an awesome game. I hope that you guys enjoyed this trivia of Thanksgiving. It's a lot of information that I never knew about. You could see all the people I actually interviewed, they didn't know about. I wonder if you guys did, but Les, I want you guys to put everything that you're thankful for in the comments below. This is Jonathan Elias and back to the studio.